Hi, today I am making a birthday card. Um, I have a friend, we're going out of town this weekend to Gatlinburg. And I was hurting up making this card and I thought I'd do a quick video. I got everything cut out already. So I just uh, put it together. So uh, my, it's an A2 card. It's opening this way. It's uh, five and a half by four and a quarter. This one is five and a quarter by four. Let me get my glue gun. My ATG here. And I did uh, emboss this. My cuddle bug folder. And we're going to do a little extra since it's embossed. Make sure it sticks. Um, we're a group of friends that we all met from boating at Lake Cumberland. So that is why I am making this anchor birthday card. Um, let's see, I'm going to put that down flat because I'm going to pop the birthday sentiment up. So, glue here. I'm going to glue this with the multi Tombow glue. And I did use the silhouette for this, and I will have the numbers listed on the screen for you and over at my blog. So if you don't want to pause it to get it, you can just go over to my blog and read what I have there. Okay, and then this is the happy birthday. It's going to go together like that. Let me get my zig. And get a lot of glue on here. I chose one with this background so I could pop it up. A lot of... <laughs> A lot of glue here. A lot of glue in. Okay, I'm gonna pop this right on here. Oop, let me get my dot. I left it on the mat so I wouldn't lose it. sparkle on it so I'm going to use the GL Clear Wink of Stella and just kind of go over some of the spots on here or go over the letters I should say I love this pen it's so quick and easy just to add some sparkle to it I also just got the Cricut Explore, so I am working on learning that when I get back. I, I will be posting some videos and projects that I make with that as well. Okay, looks good. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Let's see if you can see the sparkle. Not sure. But there's that. Super cute. Get my foam tape. Put on the back of this. Oops. I 
I, this is one of my faves too. I like this because I can just cut it whatever size I need it to be. Works out perfect. One more little piece. I think it's probably plenty, but I'll put a couple more little squares on there just to be sure. Okay. Pull this off. And I just have one one thickness of foam tape. And her favorite color is blue, so that's why I chose blue. Okay. Right there. So oh, I'm loving this, loving this, loving this, loving this. So fun. We're all having withdrawals from the lake. So we thought we'd get together at Gatlinburg. And it's supposed to be really cold and snow, possibly. Touch this up a little bit. Not looking forward to that at all. Okay. Oh, I just, I'm loving this. I'm so happy with this. This was a last minute thing, but I'm loving it. Okay. Okay, I'm going to put a piece in the inside. Make sure I cut it right. I tend to miscut once in a while. Especially when I'm rushing. Got fuzz on here from somewhere. Okay. There's that. And I'm going to add a small strip of this red on the inside to give it a little more pop of color along the bottom. Well, it's going to have to stay. I'm off a little bit, but I know I'll get a little red, red pen. Touch that up a little bit so it's not so obvious. There we go. No one ever know. And then I'm going to write a little something on the inside. So here's my card. I also made her this wine glass with her initial on it. Let's see, let me put something on the back of it. There's the K for her name, Carrie. And I glittered the stem. And I also cut her out an anchor. Um, out of vinyl for her, for her window of her car. It matches the same one as on her card. So if you have any questions, let me know. Thanks for stopping by, and I'll see you again soon. Bye.